<laughs> At approximately 8.03 this morning, the Coffee County Sheriff's Department received a call to go to the intersection of Pocahontas and Maple Spring, Springs Road in our county. Upon their arrival, they found a female beating victim uh, at that location. Uh, we later learned that they left from a residence uh, on Maple Springs Road of 7951. Uh, we were sent to that residence where we found a male uh, victim who appears to have been sh shot numerous times at the back door. At this time, we are not looking at this as a domestic situation. It is being worked as a homicide assault. Uh, we are also not uh, right now looking at this as an uh, unknown home invasion type homicide. Our investigators are on the scene. They'll be on the scene for quite some time. Uh, I, I can't release names at this time because uh, one of the victims uh, is not from the state. We're still trying to notify next to Ken. Um, I cannot release a lot at this time other than our investigators are at an active crime scene. Uh, the state medical examiner is en route to uh, uh, the crime scene and as soon as things uh, appear uh, to come together, I'll, I'll you. You just said Is there only one crime scene right now? There is only one crime scene at this time. Not working it as a home invasion at this time. The relationship between these two people? Uh, uh, fiance. Uh, they live together and uh, we're engaged to be married. Do you know ages or anything? Uh, yes. One was born in 1976, the other born in 1971. Well, I think the initial reports that maybe came in on the scanner was that this woman was running down the street, you know, covered in blood and asking for help. Is that true or was that? That is true. Um, and also, um, what about area schools? We had heard that maybe New Union and Deerfield had been put on lockdown. No, they were not put on lockdown. Uh, we are not actively pursuing anyone in that area. Uh, we did send off to one of the victim's children from one of the schools but, uh, to get kids, them to the family. How many kids do they have? Uh, they don't have any together. One of our victims has three children.